Welcome to the next Gen 8 EM Blueprint 2019. Architecture basics explained in 3 minutes. Created by Next Gen 8 EM Champion RXL 2020.eu. The Next Gen 8 EM Architecture Blueprint contains of three layers. The first layer is the endpoint devices layer for the ATM and customer owned devices. The second layer is the app services layer, providing the services to the endpoint devices, and the third layer. The third layer is the infra layer of the ATM deployer with ATM channel services. The endpoint devices layer is designed to leverage on the current mobile app development technologies for the same app customer experience on the ATM as on the mobile phone. The next gen blueprint support customer owned devices, like the mobile phone but contactless cards too. The ATM endpoint device will contain of appliance provider specific hardware and software, shown in the color orange. Can contain provider specific multi vendor software, and other software shown in gray. And deployer specific user interface app, shown in green. Which are connected through standard provider agnostic APIs in blue. Like JavaScript, ECMA Script 6, and leverage on the XFS standards. The app service layer 2 is designed to leverage on cloud based technologies, using app and open API models. There is a level playing field of provider agnostic app services in blue, like test and certification services. Provider specific app services in gray, and appliance specific services in orange. The Infra Layer 3 is designed to leverage on cloud based technologies and open API models. There are provider agnostic services in blue, like the payment network gateways to the international schemes, and more deployer specific services in green. Now you know the next Gen 8 EM Blueprint architecture basics, and you are up to speed for version 1.5 of the next Gen 8 EM architectural blueprint, which has been produced by the Architectural Review. During April to May 2019, it has been submitted to the Standards, Technical and Governance Committee of the Consortium for Next Gen ATMs. For discussion and approval in May 2019. Public comment is welcomed for a three-month period, from June till September 2019. Send your comments to Mike Lee, CEO of Atmia, by email to mike at atmia.com. Feedback is welcome, from both within the industry and from the general public. RXL 2020 is your guide to Next Gen ATM. Let's connect and meet, at the Next Gen Atmia Consortium or Work Group Meetings. The Atmia Global Webinar Unstoppable, on August 7th, about the Next Gen ATM wave of innovation. Or during my Atmia Europe 2019 workshop in Rome, where all roads lead to Next Gen Atmia. Thank you for your three minutes, and wish you a nice day.